Tola Olaole Peter, you're welcome to our educational TV channel, Scholars Card TV. This afternoon, I want to take a look at the topic LCM. The full meaning of LCM is lowest common multiple. And when we say LCM, LCM of a group of number is the smallest multiple common to all the numbers. Now, let us look at a question, some example. Let's look at some example here. Now, for you to find out SM, before, before we find, uh, do some example, for you to find out SM, we use our prime numbers to find SM. And what is prime number? Prime numbers are numbers that can only divide itself and one. An example of prime numbers are two, three, four, uh, two, three, five, seven, eleven, thirteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty-three, and so on and so forth. So there are numbers that can only divide itself and one. I repeat again, 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23, and so on and so forth. Now let us look at, take, take a look at some question. Now we have 15, 45. This is LCM of two numbers. Yeah, put it like this, draw a line, we write our 15, we write 45. Now, we use our prime number to find our SM, like I said earlier. Now, the first prime number is 2. When you use 2 to find SM, uh, 15, we use 2. Can 2 go in 15 without remainder? If it's give us remainder, definitely we use the next prime number. But can 2 go in 15? No, it will give us remainder 1. That is 7 remainder 1, so it can't divide it. Then 45, can 2 go in 45? It still give us remainder. Let's try 3. Can 3 go in 15? 3 can go in 15. Because we use 3, 3 can go in 15. 15 divided by 3 give us 5. Now write 3. 3 in 15 is what? 5. 3 in 45, that is 3 in 4, give us what? 1. 3 remainder what? 1. 3 in 15 is what? If 15 is 5, definitely 3 in 45 gives us 15. Let's check again whether 3 can still divide any of this number. Can 3 go in 5? No, it gives us remainder. Can 3 go in 15? Yes, it can go in 15. 3 in 15 gives us 5. So let us write 3 here. 3 in 5, just write 5. Since 3 cannot divide it perfectly. Now, 3 in 15 will give us what? 5. Write 5. Now, if you look at this number, this 5, 5, yeah, 3 cannot divide it perfectly because 3 in 5 is what? Is 1 in middle 2. So the next prime number is 5. Let's check. 5 divided by 5 goes, that's what? 1. So write your 5 here, you write 5. 5 divided by 5 goes, what? 1, 1. Now, our LCM, it is now time for us to multiply the word, the prime number. We're using finding the word, the numbers, finding the LCM. So we write, write. You see, 3 times 3, that's 3 times 3, times 5. 3 times 3, 9. 9 times 5 gives us 45. So our LCM here is what? The LCM of 15 and 45 is what? Is, is what is 45. Now let us take a look at another example. Another example here, yeah? we have this question. Let's check 20, for, uh, 20, 30, and uh, 42. You write, draw your line, 20, you write 30, then you write 42. You draw your line. Now, if you look at this three digit number, three numbers, this is LCM of three numbers. We have 20, 30, 42. You now write 2 in 20, it gives us 10. 2 in 30, we give us 15. 2 in 42, we give us that as what? 21. 2 in 10 can still go. 2 in 10 can go. So 2 in 10, right? 5. Can 2 go in 15? Yes, 2 in 15 is what? 
3 and 15 will give us remainder. So no need of read, just write your what? 15. Because 3 and 15 is what is 7 remainder 1. 2 and 21 is what is 21 because it will give us remainder 1. Now let's check again whether 3 can 2 can go. 3 can no, 2 cannot go in any of this number because it will give us remainder 2 in 5 will give us 2 remainder 1. 2 in 15 will give us 7 remainder 1. And 2 in 20 because that's what 10 remainder 1. So next prime number is what is 3. Let's check out 3 cannot go in 5 because it gives us 1 remote remainder 2. But 3 can go in 15 and it can go in 21. So let's write 3 in, 20, in 5 will give us just right of 5. See if we cannot divide it perfectly. Then 3 in 15 is what is 5. 3 in 21 is what is 7. So now let's check again. Can 3 go in any of this number? No. So you just write. Your five, whether five can go in five again. So now it's five in five give us that one. Five in five again give us one. Five in seven, just write seven because it gives us one in middle two. Now let's check whether the next prime number is what is seven because we have one, one. Yeah, so seven is next prime number. Seven in one, just write up one. All right, or one. Then seven over by seven is what? One. So we are true. We now what? Multiply the prime numbers there. So, our SCM is what? 2 times 2 times 3 times 5 times 7. Now, 2 times 2 give us 4. 4 times 3, 12. 12 times 5, 60. And 60 times 7 will give us that as what? 420. So, that is our answer. So the SM of 20, 30, and 42 is what is 420. So our answer is 420. Thank you very much. Do not forget to subscribe to our educational TV channels at, at Scholars Card TV. Thank you very much.